Hey guys, I'm Shazar here from Techno Unboxing and today I'm gonna be doing the unboxing of the Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 Pro. The box looks so colorful and as you can see on the bottom Redmi Note 7 Pro 48 megapixel camera. On the left side you can see Redmi Note 7 Pro by Xiaomi. Also on the right side of the box. On the top you will see some other details. On the bottom there's a sticker and on the back side of the box you can see some specification of this phone. The highlights here are 48 megapixel plus 5 megapixel AI dual rear camera, Qualcomm Snapdragon 675, 6.3 inch display and 4000mAh battery. Let's break this seal and quickly unbox this phone. And opening up the box you will see a section where you will find sim ejector tool. And inside this we get some paperwork and a soft case for protecting the phone from getting scratches. And finally here's our Redmi Note 7 Pro. But for now let's set this phone aside and see what else we get in the box. And here's the charger which is 5 volts and 2 amps. And a USB cable which is a USB to USB type C. Which is really nice to see in this budget phone. Ok so can't wait anymore let's take a look at the Redmi Note 7 Pro. This is the space black color. Let's take out the stickers. Also from the front. And now let's boot this phone up. And until I set up this phone, let's have a look at the physical overview of the phone. On the left side there's just a sim card slot. And on the right side there's volume rockers and a power button. On the top there's a secondary microphone, a headphone jack and a IR blaster. It's really nice to see they are still providing the IR blaster. And on the bottom there's a microphone, type C charging port and a speaker grill. And this one comes with a hybrid sim card tray which allows you to use two sim cards or one sim card and a micro SD card. On the top there's a single front facing camera, earpiece and other sensors. And on the back it has a dual camera setup, LED flash, a fingerprint sensor. On the bottom you can see Redmi by Xiaomi branding. It feels very premium. This one comes with a 6.3 inch full HD plus IPS LCD display with a resolution of 2340 by 1080 pixels with 409 pixel per inch and has a 19.5 is to 9 aspect ratio. And also it has a Gorilla Glass 5 on the front and also on the back. And this one has Snapdragon 675 and it's running on Android version 9 with MIUI 10 on top of it. And this variant that I'm holding right now is a 4 gigs of RAM with 64 gigs of storage. And also there's one more variant with 6 gigs of RAM with 128 gigs of storage. The phone feels so smooth and again the display is amazing. On the top there's a dot notch which also looks quite good. And this notch has this new shape which looks interesting and doesn't take much space like the notch on the Redmi Note 6 Pro. Talking about the design this phone looks so beautiful. The black color looks very subtle but if you want you can go for the Neptune blue or red which is more colorful. Talking about the bezels it has a thick bezels around the corners with the dot notch. And it's not completely edge to edge display there is still some bezels. And also chin is quite thick but it's unnoticeable when using the phone. But hey it's a budget phone with the powerful features. The dual camera on the back has a 48 megapixel camera with the aperture of 1.8 and the secondary 5 megapixel camera which is a depth sensor. Let's take some quick photos. And it takes photos with good details and contrast. And now let's take a photo with the 48 megapixel camera. To take the photos with the 48 megapixel camera you need to manually turn it on by going here and enable the 48 megapixel camera. And let's take a quick photo of this box here. And also it takes few seconds to process one photo so you can't take photos continuously with this mode on. And here's the photo. It takes photos with more details. This is the 12 megapixel photo and this is the 48 megapixel photo. But I think it just upscales the photo and also you can't use HDR and AI when using the 48 megapixel camera. On the front it has a single 13 megapixel selfie camera. There are lots of modes you can use like night shots and other modes. Let's see the fingerprint sensor. So I'll add my fingerprint here. And my fingerprint has been added. Let's see how fast it is. The fingerprint sensor is so fast it unlocks the phone as soon as I touch the fingerprint sensor. Now let's add a face unlock. And wow that was so fast. Let's check the face unlock. 
and the face unlock is also very fast. Although you will see the lock screen sometimes, but it's very fast. As soon as I look, it instantly unlocks the phone. This phone has 4000mAh battery and also you can expand the storage up to 256GB via microSD card. This phone is very responsive to the touch and also it feels very smooth when using it. So this was the unboxing and first look of the Redmi Note 7 Pro. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about this phone. Thanks for watching the video, I hope you really enjoyed. For more videos like this, subscribe to my channel and turn on bell notification to get notified every time I upload a new video. And also follow me on social media. The links will be in the description below.